there there YouTube fans, welcome, <clears throat> welcome to Art for the Heart Painting Show. I'm Artist Mark, and behind me, well, is a 16 by 20 canvas. And usually I'm painting on a 11 by 14 canvas, but uh, as you can tell, this is a 16 by 20 canvas. And I thought what I'd do here in this video is... Uh, do a painting and call it a nice day, or a nice day at the waterfalls. Hey, that'd be, that'd be a nice, that'd be a good night. A nice day at the waterfalls, and I'll put a waterfall in there. Okay, first of all, is, uh, let's see, I'll need some linsey oil. And I'll put some linsey oil in here, and, uh, now this is, uh, I'm on the set right now, okay, but it's a painting set, alright. We're going to get started with this one, let's see, well, let's see if I can get some, uh, I need to put some more blue paint on here, and let's see if I get more, oh, orthrene blue, orthrene blue, that's a pretty color, orthrene blue. I got some impression blue too. Impression blue is real strong to use. Oh yeah, there we go. Uh huh. Orthrene blue. Oh man, what a beautiful color. All right. Put that orthrene blue in there. Put a little linsey oil onto my brush, and here we go. All right. This is a how-to video, by the way. <clears throat> Make sure that you <clears throat> leave me comments and subscribe to my channel. It would mean a lot to me. <clears throat> okay. Now, let's see here. Yeah. We, we go this way. <clears throat> now, if y'all really want to get a real good laugh, <clears throat> uh, I made three, two bloopers already. Uh, videos of two two bloopers. So if y'all want a real good laugh, then y'all need to watch those bloopers because you will be laughing. <clears throat> if you want a real good laugh, you need to watch those bloopers. And plus two, I got to tell y'all that. Uh, let's see. What else? Oh, oh yeah. I did a commercial. Now, I filmed a commercial, and the commercial is talking about the uh, Art for Art painting show. So, uh, you view that. If you have not viewed that one, view it. Now, I'm going to get me some paper towels or whatever I have in here. Wipe this green paint off my brush. Green paint. I about need to took a bath in this green. <laughs> oh man! <laughs> you don't want to do that. <laughs> All right, we got to get some color under these bushes here. And let's see. Well, I think we can use this one. Yeah, there we go. And these are. There you go. All right. This. This. All right, good. And then we're going to put some right there, one right there. And these are background bushes, so you don't, if you're not looking for very much paint, it does not make that much paint. And when you do something like this, don't, don't destroy all of your darts. You need to leave some of your darts in there. Okay, just leave some of your darts in there, man, because you don't want to destroy all of them. All right. 
There we go. Ooh, yeah. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Then we're getting some, let's see, we can get this and some more, oh yeah, yeah, right here, more bushes right here, and let's see, there you go, now, we'll watch this bush and oh, it's thinner. you know what, right before it uh, walked here in the set, uh, or came here in the set, if you notice I'm wearing a, a button, if you notice this button, uh, if you go on and watch one of my videos I did a while back, uh, one called foot, uh, Cabin in the foothead, uh, Foothills, okay, well, if you, if you go back, if you view that one, you'll see me wearing a button like this, so, uh, I'll try to show it to you at the end. Okay, now we got this. Let's put on some. Let's put on some highlight. Uh, yeah, here we go. Put on some highlight this way, and this is a number three fan brush I'm using. Number three. Oh yeah. <laughs> Woo, that look good. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. This one, the, oh man, look at that green I'm putting on there. Oh, see this green paint? Alright, now this is what, oh, I'm going to put in a little bit of yellow too. Oh yeah, yeah, pretty. Let's see. A little bit more in there. Uh-huh, nice. You do everything further away in the background as possible, and then you work towards the front. Does that make sense to y'all? Yeah, it makes sense, don't it? Okay. So you do everything further away in the background. Now, this is a big tree right here. Actually, this is about three trees, uh, four trees. I'm looking at a, I'm looking at a picture. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, boy, here, here we go. Don't, like I said, don't destroy all of your darts. When I upload this to YouTube, y'all, y'all see what I'm talking about, okay? So you want to leave some, some opening areas there in your painting. So it's best, y'all, to leave some opening areas in your paintings and not destroy all those darts and then keep some of those, uh, some of those opening areas in there. Yeah, there we go. Big old tree right here. My ears were getting away from me. But <clears throat> that's what happens when you've been painting as long as I have. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> oh, hi. Yeah. Now these are trees, and you you'll see those trees in, in a little bit. Oh, I gotta get some more yellow on here. I love the paint. Oh man, the painting is so much fun to do. Oh, woo. You, you would never dream how much fun painting can be. Oh man, I gotta tell y'all, I love to do this. And uh, I'm gonna put some, how, oh yeah. Oh man, look at that. Wow. That comes, that start looking good. Uh huh. Yes, sir. Here we go. with it and now we're going to come down here and put some more right here thing don't behave itself <laughs> no there we go there we go there we go now we'll come back and put some land in there too and let's see Ooh, here we go There we are. Yeah. See if we can put some right here. Okay. And then we're going to 
push, push up a bush right there and put in another bush. Now wash this brush out. There's a can down here in the waste paper basket that has a screen to it, like a metal screen. And I put Otis paint thinner in that screen in that coffee can. Then I then I rinse my brush out. Because I don't like to wash my brush out in turpentine. Turpentine stinks. If you had never smelt if you had never smelt turpentine, you ought to get you some and try to take a whiff of it. It smells bad. Oh. Whew. I do not like to smell turpentine at all. It stinks. Of course, you know, that's that's up to y'all if y'all want to use turpentine. That's, but I'm not going to use turpentine on my show. Alright. Well, that's just me, but I don't want to use turpentine on my show. That's up to the, the individual. Now, I'm going to show y'all. Let's see, I'm going to do some land for us. Yeah, let me do some land. So I'm going to use a knife for this. Yeah. Maybe this crack, right? Yeah, there we go. I could have done that with a with a brush. Almost, huh? I'm going to scoop that down because there's supposed to be a rock there. You want a rock? Let me show you. Yes, we're gonna put some land in here. Woo. Dude, we're gonna we're gonna put some land in here. Alright. We'll get this brush. Let's see oil. Go back in some Van Dyke Brown. Like so. There you go. Okay. Go back in some of that dark color up there. There we are. And now we'll let's see. Let's see what we're going to do. Oh, let's put some land right here. Yep, right there is some land. Do some land right there. Like I said, now this is 16 by 20. Now I'm just pushing this back and forth. Now in painting, you have what you call, uh, well, prime, I, I had always primed this canvas, but when you're priming this or whatever, you use what you call vertical. Vertical means you go straight down, horizontal means you go straight across. So this is this is horizontal right here. Yeah, there we go. I guess y'all didn't know that, huh? Well, y'all do now. <laughs> Woo. Well, here you go. Here's one tree right there. Oh yeah, there's a tree. And let's see. We'll do another tree right here. The painting has four trees in it, I think. I'm probably going to do three. <clears throat> there we go. Get my brush wet. Yeah, there we go. It's like so. Oh, I 
light this brush off. Again, <clears throat> and this brush is a, what size brush is this? One and a half inch, one and a half inch. That's the size of this brush. Okay, let me show you how you do a waterfall. Okay. Now, if you if you're doing this, go in, get you a, a fan brush. Okay, go in some if you got some white paint, uh, go into your white paint, and here's how you do a waterfall. You go shoom like this. Like that. It's great if you make those sound effects. Shoom like that. Then turn your brush up and give it a splash. Like this. See? Easy to do. Something like that. Something. There you go. Turn your brush up. <clears throat> I'm going to put some paint off to the side back here in the back. Okay. Well, hang on just a minute. Okay. So I'm gonna have to let that brush soak for a few minutes. While it's soaking, we're gonna go a little bit strip a step further and ooh, we're gonna do some highlight on these trees. Right there. Yeah. There you go. here in the back. Go fix that here just a minute. <clears throat> See if I got another brush to use. Oh, I know. I know now. You put some branches on these trees. Yes. No, so we're going to use number one brush. That's a script line brush. And you need to put some tree lamps on these. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Look at there. Y'all see it? I'm going to see if I can make it a little darker when y'all can really see it. I'm going to go into some different browns. Yeah, there we go. I'm going to get this a little bit more darker, and you're going to come on here and do this side. There we go. Okay. Like 
so there we go. This is so much fun. I, I'll tell you all what. I really enjoy doing this. I really do. Now, when I, uh, when I do this, uh, make sure that you uh, read the write-up. Read the write-up to these videos. Okay? Put in a little bit more grassy look to it. Yeah, there we go. I need a brightness area up right there. Oh, there we go. Kind of brighten it up just a bit. Woo, there we go. Green back here. I need to brighten it up just a little bit more with some yellow. There we go. This is series one, okay. This is this is series one, and I'll I'll put that in the write up as well for y'all to see, okay. But make sure make sure y'all that y'all read, read the write up, and it, it'll tell you about. It. But this is series one. Now we're gonna put some some grass along in here like this. There you go. And let's see. I want to put a little bit more yellow and stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Sir, there we go. Yeah. Put some. Let's see if we can brighten that one up just a little bit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there we go. Nice. White Day at the Waterfall. Uh, at the Waterfalls. That's been the name of this one. Of course, I already told you all that. And put a more tree activity up there. Yeah, if y'all want a real good laugh, then view those view those uh, bloopers. You will be laughing. You will be laughing. I'm gonna make that into a little bit more bushy look. I need to be more bushy. Yeah, there we go. It need to be a little bit more bushy. Make those bushes a little bit taller. These are background bushes, and so they need to be up, up there a little bit. Okay, and let's see. Uh, I'll put them a row of bush, bushes down here. These don't. These don't have to be all that tall. Uh, these are just like background bushes. This is part of the middle ground, and then you have what you call the foreground. You got a background, foreground, and a middle ground. And these, this is in the background. Oh boy, there we go. Woo! There you, now you're talking about a bush. <laughs> yeah. yeah, boy. Look at that bush. There ain't no more those bushes, I guarantee it. They said they know how to do it. These are new new brushes, and this is a size size one. It's a, a, it's a one inch. And there, I don't know the size of this one. <laughs> hey, I've just been having this brush for a long time. Let's see. Oh yeah, that makes good bushes. Oh yeah. Kind of reminds me of a mop brush, but it's not a mop brush. Kind of reminds me of like a mop brush, but it's not a mop brush at all. All right. All right, and let's see. Let's see here. There you go. And 
Let's see, one more. Right now, some of these, but ooh, yeah, no, yeah, there you go. Without cleaning this brush, I'm getting into some green paint and just tapping that. You don't want to kill, all the, uh, like I said, you don't want to destroy all those darks. You need to leave some dark, uh, leave some, uh, need to leave some light there. Don't want to destroy all of that. <clears throat> I'm gonna do something here for us. Yeah. Get some white paint and let's see. Oh, there you go. Yeah. There's a tree. Doing the bark on the tree. Bark on that tree. See, we'll put some highlight right down here on this little rock there. Okay. Oops. Alright. Oh, I know what I'm gonna do right quick for off the air here. Uh, oh yeah. Oh man. Woo. Yeah, that looked good. <laughs> and wait until I upload this to YouTube. You know, that they all be able to see this bush. Oh oh man. Look at that bush. Woo. Yeah, that is a bush right there, baby. That is a bush right there. You all saw that bush? Oh man. There's a bush. There's a bush. Alright. Well, I think this one about get it. And uh I'm or uh, uh gotta make sure there's bush <laughs> I gotta make sure there's br brushes soak. Hey, thanks for watching. Uh, Art for Heart painting show. And I'm Artist Mark. And I'll upload this to YouTube. And hey, join me next time on another Art for the Heart painting show. See you then. Bye.